Okay, this is the Czech VZ26 submachine gun uh, in 762 Tokarev caliber. Uh, these came out a few years before the Uzi. Uh, the Israelis actually captured some from Egyptian commandos uh, in the late 40s and basically nicked the design. Uh, the magazine in the pistol grip, the wraparound bolt, uh, the barrel which goes all the way back to here, uh, which the Uzi gets the credit for, was actually nicked from this. Uh, as you've just seen, this version deactivated by DMB Militaria comes with a high impact fake resin bolt. Again, if it, everything is all passed by the proof houses, everything's EU legal. Uh, the stock is interesting, you can fold down the butt plate to make a foregrip, uh, or you can just extend the stock how it's meant to be used. Uh, other interesting features of this gun. Uh, has a magazine loader built into the side. So really good check engineering, precision engineering. Uh, and the gun doesn't really get the credit it deserves. Historically, it was the first submachine gun with all the, all the, all the features I mentioned earlier. Um, and a really good gun. You still find them in Central Africa, real, real bad places like the Congo, uh, Zaire, those sort of places. They're still around, they don't break, they don't go wrong, and they're very reliable.